we're back and um, super, super full disclosure with you guys. I ch went to go home, play with the baby, and uh, I lost what I was hunting. But Jaime is in here hunting with the bow, first time ever. So I'm gonna try to help him out as much as possible. And uh, yeah, let's hope he gets something so we get another deer kill for the boys. All right, see you then. Got this nice little rattlesnake right here. And by little, I really mean little. Right three feet, nothing too crazy. Hanging down the road. So I read or listened to something sort of recently that certain rattlesnakes don't rattle anymore because it gives away their position to their predators. And this dude is that type of rattlesnake. He didn't rattle at all. Goodbye. All right, found the buck from this morning. Jaime's on his way to go get an angle on him. He's looking back at us though. And then all the deer from this morning are right here too. Oh my God, there's five. Okay, I wonder if that spikes back. So we got four right there. And you got the bigger guy right here. Ooh, focus, what's going on? looking at the truck as he should because he's smart. I'm gonna keep an eye on him, I'll keep you guys posted. Oh, come on, Jaime. That's a good deer right there. Really good deer. Dude, he is so nice. And he's looking right at where Jaime and Will are. As one trillion percent the one I stalked this morning. Our big buck crested over. We got this guy right here. Can't identify what he is. Oh, my microphone's on. Is it on? It's on. Hey. So this is working well. Trying a little Bluetooth mic. Um, but yeah, okay. Now right, we're talking. I don't know what this dude's doing. I don't know what he is. Picture quality is absolutely great. Might just be a spike. Yeah, he ain't nothing. Or she. That's the spike. I might have screwed it up for uh, for Hyman. So we relocated him. I drove all over because no one was texting me. And uh, we got him. They were walking towards him. I might have blown it. They're still walking towards them very slowly. They're just cautious now. He's definitely nice. He's super nice. Jaime's behind a bush right now. He said he's 100 yards. So 
there's Jaime. He's trying to get the angle. And the buck looked like it was slowly dropping down, which isn't good. Walking the wrong way. They got buck doe. Spike. And then there's another doe in here somewhere. Same general area all of a sudden. Oh, I messed that up. Yeah, I was trying to get ahead of the deer and push it back and bump it back towards Jaime, but I just took up and over by just going backwards. So, Well, he didn't get him, and I feel absolutely horrible. I was just on the phone with Will, who's also with us. He said the uh, he said the buck was walking towards him. He was 85 yards, and here I come screaming down in my car. They freeze and just pause, and then don't move, and then you know eventually start walking away. I got my people confused. I thought uh. I thought I was looking at Jaime, but reality was, I think I was looking at Will looking at the deer. The whole reason I went down there is I couldn't see Will and no one was texting me. So I thought he was too far over and wasn't able to see him. What's the learning lesson from this? If your buddies aren't texting or calling you while they're looking at deer, they're probably about to shoot one. So I feel absolutely horrible. So check with you guys a little later.